Wolfpeg command would convert a video for iPad slash iPhone slash iPod. I'm currently using a batch file which, amongst other things, runs the following handbrake lie command line to convert a video. Handbrake lie.exe v0 input d column backslash input dot mkv preset equals universal iPod atom t1 angle 1 gain 0 output equals d column backslash output dot mp4. This has served me well for many years, producing a video file which is smaller than the original, good when you only have 16 GB devices, looks good enough and works on pretty much any iPod, iPad and iPhone I put it on. However over time Handbrake Lie is struggling to convert more and more videos to the point that I need to look for an alternative. It's not helped by the fact that the logs provide absolutely no information as to why it has crashed. This video, for example, crashed at 71% through the conversion and this is the last 4 lines. Not very helpful. I looked at using FMEG as an alternative, but all the examples I've seen on the internet do one or more of the following. Don't work, command line options aren't recognized, common. Result in a file which is larger than the original, very common. Distort the picture, especially when an unexpected video size is converted, e.g. non-widescreen PAL, Remove the audio. Result in a video that the iPhone, iPod or iPad won't play. Is there a decent all-purpose pump command line which will make any video run happily on all Apple device plus achieving a reduction in file size? Bonus points if it'll shrink, but not distort, any video over 720p2. Here's my take on it. I'll take the iPhone 4 or newer, including all iPads, as the target, H.264 main profile, level 3.1. The values you are free to change. CRF 23, the constant quality setting. Higher value equals less quality, smaller file. Lower equals better quality, bigger file. Same values are, 18 to 24. Preset medium, if this is too slow for you, use a faster preset. If you have the patience for it, use a slower one. See here for more information. A codec copy, tries to copy the audio track into the MP4 container. If it can't be copied, you will have to re-encode it to AAC slash MP3 slash ACT3. E.g., a codec lib 3 lane. If your video is greater than 720p, add the following after the input. VF scale equals 2 column 720 column flags equals launchosh. This will shrink your video to 720p, and keep the aspect ratio. The scaling algorithm used will be launchosh as it is much better than the default, 